Welcome back. My name is Dr. Iyer. I'm with Residence Medical, and we have another high-yield USMLE case for you. So the case starts like this. We have a 34-year-old female presenting with a new constellation of symptoms. She has a fever, chills, headache, muscle pains, and dry cough. She has a new pet bird that she bought recently a few weeks ago. And other than that, besides smoking a pack a day, she doesn't have any medical conditions, doesn't take any meds, and has all her vaccinations up to date. You can see an x-ray to help you give a hint to this diagnosis. What do you think the diagnosis is? Don't forget to like, comment, and share. Come back next time for the answer. Were you able to figure out what the answer to this case was on your own? If not, don't worry. The answer was psittacosis. And this is caused by chlamydophila cetacei. Chlamydophila cetacei is not chlamydia, it's chlamydophila. So be careful with the confusion or distinction there. And it's a very common infection in birds that can actually spread from birds to humans. And that's what happened with our case here. And you saw in the chest x-ray, there were infiltrates that were spread out throughout the lung. That's a very classic characteristic of psittacosis. And it's a very easy treatment as well for this condition. You don't need to do anything complicated, just give tetracycline or doxycycline. And you have to be careful with these medications in kids and pregnant women, as you know, because they can cause some birth defects and damage to the children. In those cases, give erythromycin. Finally, the complications that can happen if this case is not treated appropriately or not diagnosed in time after a few years include some serious things, such as endocarditis, hepatitis, pneumonia, and encephalitis. So it pays to treat it very early. Thanks for your participation in this case. Don't forget to like, comment, and share. See you next time.